Hello, my name is Andreas Andersson. Uh, I'm a professional fly tire from Sweden, also working with uh, Arix hooks on product development. So if you have tried their hooks, it's very possible that, that you have uh, tied on, on one or two hooks that, that I have designed. What I'm here to show you today is uh, an updated version of an old pattern of mine. It's called the Delivery Man. It will still have my very much a signature with reverse tied craft per head. A couple of the, the small updates I made is I try and leave a lot of the back hook uh, bare. This makes it a little bit easier to get out of a fish's mouth, especially a, uh, a pike or another like toothy uh, fish without ruining the fly. If you, tie, if you tie on the back part here and you put a plier to that, you can actually mess up the fly quite badly. So most of the materials will be at the front half of the fly, even though it's reaching back some eight or nine inches. Uh, another update that's probably hard to see, but I've actually added some, um, some of Blaine Chocolate's body tubing to the uh, front part of the head here and this just make it a little bit broader giving it a little bit more of a water push but also it helps with the creating a, a very like natural uh, profile of the fly while the first uh, first version of the deliverman had a lot slimmer head that will cut water sideways this will more grab water and send up shock waves to I guess ring the dinner bell for the fish which is uh, also a very good thing, especially in, uh, in like murky water or at night. So that's a few of the updates. Uh, so I'll be showing you how I tie this fly now. And uh, hopefully you'll enjoy it and learn something. Thank you. The, the hooks I've chosen for, for this one uh, in this particular size is a Arix Hooks TP615 and a uh, TP610, a little bit wider gape to accommodate hooking, even though it's a big head, so I wanted a bigger hook gap.
Uh, jag är en idiot. Vänta, du har inte tagit kort. Det är rätt bra. Sorry, we had a little incident uh, concerning a very sharp scissor and my thumb. <laughs> so we had to wipe some blood off the floor, but everything is good. Let's go. As always, uh, on this channel, if you want a chance to win this fly and take it out and fish it for yourself, try it on your home water, uh, please sub subscribe and leave a comment in the comment section on why you should win the fly. Thank you very much.